If everyone acted the same, thought the same, it'd be a pretty boring place to live if you ask me. What do I know? How are y'all doing tonight? I figured I'd make a video more than a few seconds long since you were kind enough to click. Uh, I'm not doing a whole lot, as you can tell. You're looking at it right here at my residence. 3308 Rogers Road, Graham, North Carolina, 27253. If there's any questions, anyone has any uh, qualms they would like to take up with me, here I stand, here I sit, rather. And uh, just let me know. I know you don't like me. Quite frankly, I don't really care. Someone once said, uh, British Prime Minister, man, that I'm drawing a blank. As soon as, I, as soon as I hit stop on this video, I'll think of it. But Someone once said, if you have enemies, good. That means you stood for something in this life. And if that's the case, wow. I must have stood for a whole lot. Because there's an awful lot of people out there that have never met me, do not know me personally, have not ever become formally acquainted with myself, yet they have tons and tons of things to say about me when they're not in my presence. And even if they were in my presence, it wouldn't bother me because I'm a peaceful person. I'm not hard to get along with at all. And you're entitled to your opinion. This is a free country the last time I checked, at least that's what it says on the papers paperwork so by all means say what you will disrespect me I'm all the all the better you know it doesn't phase me one bit one iota I, I really don't know what else to say I can't think of one person that I wake up in the morning and be like oh I hope he gets it today I hope she gets it today because that's not what life's about. I don't know a whole lot, but I do know this much. What was that? I seen a meme one time. Hating someone is like drinking poison and expecting the other person to die, and that's so true. And here on my end, I embrace the hate because you can't make everyone happy. And if you can't make them happy, you can't make them love you. I'm not suggesting make them, making them hate you, but hell, we all got to go sooner or later, and I can promise you one thing, this ugly mug right here will be remembered, for better or worse, because I was an individual, and it cost me my life, and there's no other way to put it, to uh, those coming up. In this rough world, such a, a harsh climate, environment, do as you're told. Listen to your elders. Chances are they're telling you that for a good reason. You know, we're all knuckleheads once upon a time in our lives. We all do stupid things, but you gotta, you only get one brain. Don't abuse it. And always, uh, Exercise forethought. Think before you act. Because a split second decision can ultimately cost you the rest of your life. And that's no joking matter. I've lived it, I've experienced it. And I'm not preaching to the choir, but if I were to, you'd always be welcome to have a seat on one of my pews. Did I pronounce that right? I'm not sure. Well, thank you for your time. God bless. Have a wonderful evening. Thanksgiving's coming up. Be sure to get with your family. Spend as much time with your family as you can. Tomorrow's never promised for any of us. Christmas is right around the corner. Merry Christmas to everyone. And I'm sure I'll be checking in again before then. Lord willing. Thank you. Good night. God bless.